Qualcomm has become the new front of shirt sponsor for Manchester United Football Club. This, the company's latest attempt to boost awareness of its Snapdragon brand among consumers amid a broader push into personal computing. And here to not only discuss this massive commercial deal, but also <laughs> illustrate, demonstrate it, is Bloomberg's Oni and King, who leads our semiconductor coverage and just so happens to be a Manchester United fan. But there it is. <laughs> you know, it, it's something that you just didn't think you'd ever see. But for Qualcomm, this is a big, big deal. Right. So th this is not even just the company name. This is their brand. This is them trying to do something that they've really been trying to do for 10 years and not making a lot of progress in. And now they're saying, look, this is how committed we are. This is what, what we're prepared to put money behind. And obviously, this is a very big brand. How much money are we talking, Ian? They, they won't, neither, neither side will tell us, but we have a report saying uh, about $75 million a year, and it's going to probably stretch over five years. Uh, Director Alice, you know, I'll just try and get this. I, I hold up for me. There you go. Yeah. I mean, the point is, is that it's a chip. It's a semiconductor, historically, that Qualcomm's put into smartphones. There's an AI story with it now. It, there's a cult following around it. Right. Just explain its next iteration. Yeah, I mean, the, the most important thing here is they want, they've been trying to get their chips into laptops for a long time. Hasn't really happened. Now they're saying new AI software will help them to do that. But what's happening behind the scenes, the kind of giant elephant in the room here, like Manchester United in the 90s, a very successful team, is Intel. Intel have dominated this market, not only with their products, but with their brand, right? That anybody who's trying to get into laptops has to take on the Intel Inside brand. And this is what Qualcomm is trying to do with this and other efforts. Ah, uh, just that word takes me back to the Beckham documentary and when all the feel-good factors around, whether it's England, whether it's Man U, I mean, I think Eric Cantona's had something to do with the marketing of all of this, Ian. And just how many of these tech names or US tech names are going into sports like this to big up their name. How much do you see chips more broadly get into the world of football or soccer? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, diff I mean, it's an ingredient brand, so it's always been sort of one step back. Intel were the ones that really broke that with the Intel Inside campaign and really pushed the idea that, hey, you don't buy something for the company that makes it, you buy something because of what's inside it. And Qualcomm are trying to make that next step. They, they're the first. We've seen other companies sort of flirt with this, but this is probably the biggest effort we've seen so far to really get a content brand, a content sort of product in front of real consumers who, who ultimately right. be the ones well, that Well, Qualcomm's saying that one Premier League home game will have the same value to them as, as spending on a Super Bowl ad. That's what we're talking about.